out of that flag burning spree in Long Beach, one arson was caught on camera. We're learning more about the man who was arrested. He's behind bars being held on $3 million bail. Community journalist Jake Patel has the latest. <laughs> Check out this video of a man walking up to a Long Beach home and setting an American flag on fire around 3.30 in the morning Thursday. This is just one of many flags that were burnt. We're now learning more about the suspect. Long Beach police say he's 35-year-old John Leo Mailer, a resident of Laguna Niguel who was booked on 13 counts of arson, one count of arson to an inhabited structure, and violation of parole. His bail is listed as $3.25 million. Neighbors are shaken but angry this happened in their quiet neighborhood in East Long Beach. For many, their own family members have served. Gil Ramirez says his father was a Marine and put up their flag outside his house. Ramirez says he broke the news to his father, who was sad to hear about what happened. I think of my dad and uncles who were in combat and stuff like that. Those are the real tough guys, not this little twerp, you know, going around silently, you know, burning down flags. After torching several American flags in this neighborhood, he came to this home and set their flag on fire, which caused this car fire and threatened their home. We had both seen that my best friend's house was on fire across the street. So we called them, he ran over, and we were able to get him out of the house, but we saved them, but not the car. The car was fully engulfed. Speak. Oh, <laughs> Alexis Lennon credits her dog Luca for barking and alerting them and others in the neighborhood. If you walk down the street now, it's a much different scene thanks to Bradley Malstead, who took it upon himself to replace the burned flags. I went and got the flags. Uh, they were about 10 bucks each. Some were five. I bought, I think I bought 10 or 15 and, and handed them out at homes where I saw the, the burn pole. Nothing like this has ever happened before. And by the time that it was noon the next day, all of the American flags had been replaced by one of our neighbors. Um, so we're just really fortunate. It's such a tight knit community. In Long Beach, Jay Shapatel, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.